Hi friends, Auntie Cuckoo here. Welcome back everyone. So I am heading into Walmart and I'm inviting you guys to come along with me. Let's go shopping. So they have this end cap of seasonal ribbon by the Halloween stuff. I like the lace one and looks like they have some rickrack. So that's actually a really good deal. All these are a dollar. And that lace one reminds me of the one from the Dollar Tree. Oh, this one has spiders in it. It's pretty cool. And I like this burlap one. So I just found these really pretty witches. My other Walmarts did not get these. So I'm really surprised they have them. $10.97. They're really cute. Lots of detail. If I collected witches or something, I would definitely pick these up. Their outfits are really cute. And they're kind of like a Christmas angel in the middle, kind of hollow. But they have those left, and then they have a lot of wreaths left. So I like to go out and check out what they have left so that I know what's going to be on sale right after the holiday. That wreath reminds me of that Dollar Tree sign. Oh, it looks like they have these in the Dia de los Muertos version too. And she's really cute. Look at the detail on her outfit. And $10.97. I found another version down here on the bottom shelf. So she has the crown of flowers, different outfit with polka dots. I am really loving them. I have not seen them at my other Walmarts. So this Walmart I don't normally come to and I'm finding all kinds of fun things. This black cat I have not seen at my other Walmarts and it's really cute. So it's coming home with me. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, they have a few more of those signs. They do not have the black cat one. And this is really cool looking. It's kind of vintage looking, but it's almost five bucks. I really like this. I haven't seen anything like this before at my other two Walmarts. Little tin pumpkin face, five bucks. I'd love to pick one of these up on clearance after the holiday. I have not seen that witch sign, and it is that wooden, heavy kind of sign. And they still have, they put out more of those votive holders, so they have a lot of those. And I finally found the black cat. So you guys know I bought the pumpkin one. They're $6.98. I've never seen this in person. So I definitely prefer mine to this one. I kind of wish it was not a black dress on a black cat, but this candy corn sign I have not seen either. So very interesting. I'm at an out of the way Walmart and I'm finding lots of different things. They have a ton of the wreaths left. Now I'd never pick up that gory one, but the black one is cool and this one's really cute. And I really like this one. It reminds me of like, Disneyland or something and there's the eyeball one so those will probably be on clearance in a couple days so I picked up a sign just like this from the 99 cents only store and it's here for like four dollars so they have two versions they have this skeleton with the top hat on and it's just kind of a burlapy background and this one's really cool that says boo with the owl on it. I'm looking to see. It's just those two versions. I got mine for 99 cents. So they did put out these emoji Halloween pillows. So they have this poop candy corn, a ghost with his tongue out. And let's see, they have a pumpkin and Let's see what this is back here. A skeleton. So they have the skeleton face 
and I found some more pillows. So these are sets of two for $10.88. Now they have lots of versions. So these are out for fall. I haven't seen these at my other Walmarts either. This one's kind of an autumn leaf style. And they have a few different prints. So they have the owls that are really cute. And the one that comes with it is leaves. And this one in the grays and blues with give thanks. This black and beige version that they put out in the dish towels. This one says give thanks. And then they have this one that I know you guys have probably seen the dish towels and the dishes that are out with Hello Autumn. And then it looks like they have this one. It's really neutral with be grateful with the leaves. And then this one says friends and family. This one's really cool with the gray background and the white pumpkins. One says give, one says thanks. And the other one's just kind of like a herringbone pattern. So these are pretty good buy for fall. For $10.88 you get two pillows. So I'm guessing these will be on sale tomorrow. So I am finding all of the cute little dishes still, all these little salt and pepper shakers. The turkeys I have not seen at my other stores. I've seen the owls and the pumpkins, and I haven't seen this little fox guy. There's only one of him and the different cookie jars. So I've seen the owl ones and these at my other stores, and these are just under $10, $9.96. And then they have the matching plates and bowls and those cute little patterns all kinds of halloween mugs left and lots of tableware obviously with thanksgiving still a little ways away lots of pot holders 88 cents and different sets with the dish towels lots of vinyl tablecloths in coordinating patterns so I have not seen these in the sets at my other Walmarts, but they have a ton of them here. So that one's really cute with the little fox and the dish towels for 88 cents in the matching patterns that go with those pillows and with the dishes. And just looking, oh, they have the owl, really, really cute. There's the black and beige set. They have coordinating table mats. And that fox is cute. So they have them in the burgundy with the leaves. They have the more fun pumpkin one. They're $1.88 each. And then right around the corner, I found these pumpkins and owls and more of the burgundy with the leaves. And they remind me of the placemats from the Dollar Tree. They also have coordinating kitchen mats or rugs. They have it in the Owl. And they're only $4.97. Walmart is stepping up their lantern game. I'm finding all kinds of new decorative lanterns for candles here. These are really pretty for autumn and fall, I think. A few different gold. This one I think is really cute. This one's $11.86. I really like that. Yeah, this one I think I've showed you. I've seen this one before. And then this one I have not. It's got a twisty thing inside. They have a few up here. I have not seen this white one here. I've seen this silver okay. one. They're doing a good job. There's poor little kids falling apart all around me. This is a really cool like tin framed mirror and they have it in a grayish light tan version too. So still in the decor area I found this cool little standing chalkboard I have not seen before. It does have home sweet home. It's $12.74. And I found a new, I guess this is a rooster, you guys. 
and it's $14.88. It's pretty cool. I like the black and white. And then this pineapple is $12.74. It's really cool with the gold top. Now these were just below and these are little black ceramic puppy dogs in the Boston and in the Wiener. And I found more Pioneer Woman. So pretty much we're just going to be cruising all my new Pioneer Woman finds. Salt and pepper shaker in their cream and the butter. And then these are cool. But they're really small for $7.46. So these are little pedestals. I guess you could use them for desserts or candles or anything like that. They have all of her new prints and they're really stuck in there. So this one's like a powdery blue. And then back here, if I can get it loose, is the cranberry one. Here it is. So here is the cranberry one and they're all floral. I found some more of the mixing bowls or melamine style bowls. You get three of them. They're a plastic texture. Found some more of her ceramic items. These are the new plates she put out. Haven't seen those before. And a few new things over here I'm seeing. These I think are for like soup. They're $6.64. And these little ramekin style bowls. So these are bigger than the dipping bowls in different prints. I have not spotted these before. And these are definitely new. So this one is kind of like a teapot. It's really pretty. Very big, very heavy, jeweled knob, nice. And then this other one is just a pitcher. There's no top to it. So slightly different patterns. They're both $14.96 and $16.96. And then they have these little creamers. And this one matches the pitcher. And I'm guessing they're just little creamers. They have a red one with a floral pattern to it. And this real pretty tealy color. That one's cute. I found some measuring cups. You get four of them in different sizes. This is something I actually might pick up for myself for Christmas. They're really cute. So she put out some utensil organizers with her pattern behind them. Those are just under 20. They're $19.96. And I have not seen this runner before. So this is kind of, I would say, her most popular pattern with the teal and the roses. I've not seen it in a runner. And it looks like she's putting out these little coasters three dollars and 47 cents each you guys now they're adorable they look just like those little pedestals and they're in similar prints but they're 350 each for a coaster really pretty now she's doing this glass version in her salt and pepper shakers for 298 and it's also in the glass that's teal or jadeite. So those are really pretty. The patterned spoon holder and canister. So this matches that really big one I showed you. This one's 842. And it looks like they have it in the clear as well. And then it looks like a cookbook holder 2184. It's on a metal pedestal. So the front part is metal. It kind of just feeds into this wood slat that has her print on it. And then I found the pepper grinders. So this one's got the teal top. It has the butterfly engraving on it. And it's also in the cream or ivory with just her name on it, I think. I don't see the pattern. 
anywhere else. And this is something I haven't seen this version of her paper towel holder. It's got a red ceramic topper of a butterfly and then she also did this really heavy version of a cookbook holder in a wrought iron with her butterfly signature for 1662. Looks like she's even doing knives. So these are right next to her dishes. 1988 you get two knives. And I'm finding some more of the salt and pepper shakers. This is the really popular one, 488 with the roses. And then this one's kind of a bohemian mix of different patterns. It's also 488. And I wanted to show you guys a better, longer version of this shelf. So it is 39.98, I think. And it's pretty small. My guess is you could fit three coffee mugs on it. I did find a different version of those bowls where you get three of them. They're different patterns and they do come with lids. 1986. Cake stands we're familiar with. Love that barn cookie jar. And I don't know if I've shared these with you guys. These patterns of the batter bowls. So these are 1882. These are kind of the darker version out, I think, for the holiday. There's some more dipping bowls and a few more of her dishes and some more of those little soup mugs is what I would call them. So I'm going to wrap it up here, guys. I hope you enjoyed this Walmart shop with me and sharing all of the Halloween and Pioneer Woman goodies. I really like this. I might have to pick this up. This is the little four set of measuring cups and looks like they have a different version. So I'll see you guys very soon in the next video.